So here we're back, and the problem is that when I use um, display inline for my second list, I got some extra, this extra sliver of space between my LIs. Do you see that little gray bar to the right here? So what is that? Well, I did what any good web designer does, and that would be to Google it. So for example, I'll show you what I found out. Well, I'll show you what I did, and I'll show you what I found out. So um, what I Googled for was um, display inline extra space. And then I found a lot of awesome articles about it. And I won't read them to you now, but I will just say, when I use display inline block for this second list, it picks up the white space between my tags as actual space. So this little crufty piece of gray space over here is the actual line break in my source code between this li and the following li plus the tabs, etc. that little piece of white space. So. The extremely hacky and disgusting way to do it would be to eliminate the space between your LI tags, but that is really prone to problems. Um, you'd have to trust that your client or your engine, like WordPress, would be observing those rewriting rules, um, which I would never trust. So the other way to do it, um, which is not dependent on HTML, is to do the, is to do the following. The problem is that um, is that the OL is considering this one character worth of white space between the LIs. The LIs are fine, their, their text inside is fine, but we don't want the OL to consider this white space text. So what you do is you set the font size on the OL to zero, and you set the font size on the LI back to the normal font. Now, the, over, the Uber answer is you just don't care because there is probably no situation where you would be doing one floating list followed by, by a display inline list and trying to match the spaces up together. But if you find yourself in a situation where you're dealing with a tiny piece of space with an inline list, this is what the problem is. So quick fix and then we will leave it. So that means on my OL tag, I'll do it in the browser first so you can see it right away. I'll say on the OL tags, I'm going to set the font size to zero. Okay, now I've lost the font. I've lost all the words, of course, because um, that's what I just did, set the font size to zero. And then that means on the LIs, I need to set the font size back to whatever I want the font size to actually be, which in this case is 16 pixels is the default font size, but it would be better to set the font size to one REM, which is the um, a relative m relative to the default font size of the body tag so this is um, a very extensible way to do it now i can see that they are perfectly matching if i mouse over that li there is no longer that tiny piece of space to the right of that margin so that is the answer